The tiny African nation of Djibouti serves as a gateway to the Suez Canal and serves as one of the busiest shipping routes. It also hosts the largest American military base in Africa. Led by President Ismail Omar Gela, he is affectionately known as EOG. EOG has advanced women's rights and introduced legislations to advance their cause. For example, he increased the number of females in the armed forces. Also, more and more women now work in IT, which is usually a male-dominated world. This year, we also saw a woman become the first person to deliver mail in Djibouti. For the older generation has helped provide resources to elderly women with traditional skills so that they can continue to support themselves by making handcrafted products. Education for girls has seen great progress. Female students have increased year on year thanks to EOG's policies. The president regularly issues women in society with recognition for their contribution to the country. He is a champion for women's rights. This year, the president opened a new 750 kilometer line which will link Addis Ababa and Djibouti together again and making the freight journey significantly faster. This train is state-of-the-art and provides enough capacity to carry hundreds of passengers and tons of freight in a single journey. This train is part of the $15 billion of investments taking place in Djibouti right now. Across the region, several new developments are taking place, such as this country road connecting Tajura and Bahau. When it comes to health care, he recently opened a state-of-the-art hospital in the city of Arta. The hospital has some of the best medical equipment in East Africa. With a team of foreign medical experts working alongside skilled Djiboutian doctors and nurses, they treat dozens of patients every day. Healthcare is one of the main priorities for the president. Higher education has seen great improvements in Djibouti. A new medicine school was recently opened to excellent reviews. The medicine school is the first of its kind in Djibouti and record number of graduates have recently graduated with the president attending the ceremonies. The president is very much in touch with society and deeply cares about developing the skills of his people. The latest development is Air Djibouti, the national airline that recently started its operations flying to more than several destinations. Air Djibouti offers services such as consultancy, charter and aircraft and cargo handling. A few months ago, thousands of people took to the streets in Djibouti to show their support for the president, a rally that also included a music concert. This demonstrated the love the people have for the president. He is much loved and he is the only candidate that can continue with the rapid development of Djibouti. EOG is the only candidate that can make Djibouti prosper.